Hello friends, Kevin Devine here. Thanks for singing along with me today, the, all my Belleville Library friends. It's great to see all of you. Hope you're having a great summer and enjoying reading and having a lot of fun. So our theme this year is uh, Tales and Tales, T-A-I-L-S, Tales. That means like tales on an animal. And Tales, T-A-L-E-S, Tales. Those are called homonyms, words that sound the same. So that kind of tales is like telling a story. I'm gonna start out with a song that's from a library show I did many years ago in Watertown, Massachusetts. It's kind of like Belleville. Belleville's right on a lake. Watertown's kind of near the water. There's a river right there. But anyway, so we're going to start out. It's an old, I got the pirate hat on. You can kind of see that pirate hat. See, that's an old style pirate hat. So I'll wear the pirate hat. And it's a song about the library. And it's a tale, T-A-L-E tale, about a pirate named Captain. Then Hook. So it's a tale song, T-A-L-E, because they're uh, telling the story about a pirate, Captain Hook. Very well, I went to the library today at three to check out a book about a bumblebee. But while I was looking for my book, I went about a pirate named Captain Hook. Well, I don't have a boat, don't know how to sail, but the library's got a book about a big white whale. That book's about planes, trains, and automobiles. So can take a trip whenever I feel. If you want to learn something you don't know, or take a trip to the land where the babobs grow, or learn how to knit, or how to cook, go to the library and check out a book. Well, I don't have a boat and I don't know how to sail, but the library's got a book about a big white whale, and books about planes, trains, and automobiles, so I can take a trip whenever I feel. The library's got books on everything. Books on how to dance and books on how to sing. And books on planes, trains, and automobiles. So I can take a trip whenever I feel. I'm going to say it quiet. You yell Captain Hook loud. Ready? I went to the library today at three to check out a book about a bumblebee. While I was looking for my book, found about a pirate named Captain Hook. Well, I don't have a boat. Don't know how to sail, but the library's got a book about a big white whale. And books about planes, trains, and automobiles. So I can take a trip whenever I feel. And books about planes, trains, and automobiles. So I can take a trip whenever I feel. Take a trip whenever I felt like at the library, because you can dive right into a book. That's our first tale. I'm going to do a song about someone speaking of water. I'll put on the old captain's hat. The captain saw this and told me all about it. The captain was out on a boat and she saw this happening. It's a true story. It's a tale, T-A-L-E, tale about a girl named Jane. And Jane was um, a very fast runner. Jane was very strong. I imagine she still is, as far as I know. Um, we could check in and find out. I'm going to tune up the guitar. This is called tuning. sound just right for you guys. Ready? And you got to sing along on this one with me. I'm going to say a line and you say, oh, Janie, oh. Ready? I'll say, there once was a girl in my hometown. You say, oh, Janie, oh. Fastest runner for miles around. Oh, Janie, oh. You got it? So you say, oh, Janie, oh, after I sing my line. I'll help you out the first time through. There once was a girl in my hometown. Oh, Janie, oh. Fastest runner for miles around, oh Janie O. Oh. She ran so fast the ground would shake, oh Janie O. Oh. And once she even ran across a lake, oh Janie O. Oh. oh, how do you think she ran across the lake? Anybody? Anybody? Yes, maybe it was winter, it was frozen. Or like those barefoot water skiers that are going real fast. If she's running real fast, staying right on top. Well, oh Jane, oh Janie, oh my Janie O. Oh. Fastest runner in this old town, stole my heart. in my hometown, oh, Janie O, strongest person for miles around, oh, Janie O, she could lift up a car with just one hand, oh, Janie O, played every instrument in the band, oh, Janie O, oh, Janie O, oh, Janie O, oh, my Janie O, fastest runner in this old town, stole my heart and things slow down, oh, Janie O, oh, Janie O, oh, my Janie O, oh. I'll say it, you say it back, ready, once is a girl in my hometown, Fastest runner for miles around. She ran 
so fast the ground would shake. And when she even ran across a lake. Well, you can use your legs, make the sound of a drum of someone running like that, like. Well, oh, Jane, no, oh, Jane, no, oh, my baby, oh. Fastest run in this old town, stole my heart and never slow down. Oh, Jane, no, oh, Jane, oh, Jane, oh, my Jane, oh. Oh, Jane, oh, Jane, oh, my Jane. Right, that's two tales in a row. So we had the library one about the pirate, Captain Hook, and then O oh, Janie O, oh, the fast runner. I was gonna tell you a song. This is kind of interesting because it's about dogs. So some kids might have dog. You might have a pet dog, maybe you do. Or a cat. Well, we'll do the little story about dogs, and I'll give you a hint. You'll know the first one. You'll know, I got my dog head on. You know how they say people start to look like their dogs? So this is exactly what our dog looks like. Okay, well. That visage right there. Okay, I'll give you a hint. Here, with the accordion. You'll know the first one, all right. Yeah, I know the dog likes the accordion. He kind of gets under the couch and doesn't seem to be a big accordion fan. This is called the accordion. But it's a whole story about a dog named... That there was a farmer had a dog, Bingo was his name, O B I N G O, B I N G O, B I N G O, and Bingo was her name. Oh, you sing that part, say B I N G O, B I N G O, B I N G O, and Bingo was her name. Do barks instead of claps. Ruff, 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 and bingo was her name. So this dog, Bingo, she lived on a farm. This is the true story, so it's a bit of a tale. So if you like dogs, you'll like this. If you don't like dogs, you might like it anyway, because <clears throat> maybe it's a kind of story you like to hear about anyway. So, so as I was saying, so Bingo, <laughs> So Bingo had a cousin who lived out in the woods. Sure enough, out in the woods. And the cousin was a coyote. Who can say, oh? Coyotes are out on the prowl tonight. Coyotes are out on the prowl. Coyotes are out on the prowl tonight. In the moonlight, hear them howl say, oh. around the chicken coop and put a great big lock on the door. You think that kept the coyote out? I don't know. Say, oh. oh. Coyotes are out on prowl tonight. Coyotes are out on prowl. Coyotes are out on prowl tonight. In the moonlight, hear them howl. One more time, mom's dad, you got to howl too. Say, oh. As I said, it's a tale. So Bingo was a, the dog. She lived out on the farm. Her cousin was a coyote, lived in the woods. But she had another cousin, um, and he decided to move to the big city. He was kind of tired of living out in the country. He moved it on to the big city. And he became kind of, he thought he was pretty cool. He thought he was a cool dude dog. So when I give you the signal, he had his hat turned up like that. He was so cool. So uh, when I give you a signal, I'll go... And you say, cool dude dog. Ready goes, cool dude dog. Cool dude dog. Well, he's a small town hound on Hollywood. 
faded in his face for a coup de ville. No more chasing sticks out in the jog. He's a cool dude dog. He's a cool dude dog. Well, he wears dark glasses and a lot of gold chains. A wag of his tail can turn the sun to rain. No more chasing sticks out in the jog. He's a cool dude dog. He's a cool dude dog. When the other dog says, pretend you're running along, let's see if we're running along. And the other dog see him walking down the street. They run to the other side. He's not the kind of dog they want to be in the middle of the night. He's a small town hound going Hollywood. He traded in the leash for a group to build. Oh, no more chasing sticks out in the yard. He's a cool new dog. He's a cool new cool or at least he thought but then you know what happened he got a girlfriend yes indeed he did and her name was Rover and <clears throat> so part of this tale is that uh, you know this tale is all about dogs and dogs have tails so a tale of tales so uh, the cool dude dog got a girlfriend named Rover but she had a little problem she had fleas so fleas are little what yes little bugs that make you itch all over ready so pretend you're scratching all over <laughs> Like that sound. Remember that? That sound, like the old fog hat sound. Ready? Or um, uh, Ted Nugent sound. Like that. Ready? Scratching all over. Go. I got a dog. Her name is Rover. She's got fleas and she itches all over. I took her to the vet. Can you cure her, please? My dog has fleas. That's the part we're going to sing together. I took her to the vet. Can you cure her, please? My dog has to. Rover likes to roll in the grass and leaves. Chase all the squirrels up in the trees. When she comes in, she always makes me sneeze. Ah, My dog has to. She's got fleas on her paws, fleas on her tail. Rather scratch fleas than chase the mail. She's even got fleas on her nose and knees. My dog has to. Together, Rover and I spend a lot of time. I scratch the dog's ears, the dog scratches mine. The scratching business will be the end of me. Now I got fleas. This scratching business will be the end of me. Now I got fleas. That's it. I got fleas for the song. For Rover, so that's the tales of the tale. There's one more. We might as well do one more dog song. Well, we're actually going to finish up later on with a big cat song. So we'll do the dog song. Again. Well, the pup's got tough and she won't settle down. Put her on a leash and she'll pull you around. Pup's got tough, she likes to jump and twirl. Better hold tight if she sees a squirrel. Pup's got tough. Pup's got pep, huddle up ahead, and we're all getting wet. Well, my pup's got pep, won't settle down, put her on a leash and she'll pull you around. Pup's got pep, she likes to jump and twirl, better hold tight if she sees a squirrel. My pup's got pep, my pup's got pep, that means a lot of energy. There's a dog up ahead. That we've never met Whatever happened to that Cute little pup Look at her now Cause she's all grown up My pup's got pep Won't settle down Put her on a leash And she'll pull you around Pup's got pep She likes to jump and twirl You better hold tight If she sees a squirrel that's called Pup's Got Pep. Hey, we're going to do songs about four tales and, um, and people and animals that have tails. A tale about people, not that people have tails. Tales about people and, and, and songs about animals with tails. Hey, I was thinking this one's about, um, about people. It's kind of a tale because it's a true one, too, because it's about a girl named Kayla. And Kayla, when she was probably four, 
wrote this song one day. And, uh, and so she told me how it goes. We wrote it at her school one day. And so she was actually four at the time she wrote it. Let me think what would be a good hat. Well, she was working on the song, so I'll put on a working hat. That's a good working hat. So uh, she was working on some songs. I was working on songs with the kids, and Kayla was four, and she wrote this song. And, um, and it's a true song, and it's a true story. She uh, made it up as we were going along with all the other kids. And all you got to do is say after me. I'll say it, then you say it. Ready? It's kind of interesting to do because when you're there, I'm talking to you, and you can hear it, and you can say your part, and I'll say my part. And you can use your legs like a drum or your belly like a drum. I got my big spaceship shirt on there, so kind of far out song. Ready? Get your drums going. I'll say it, you say it. Say, ba -boo Say, hey, ba -boo -ya. Say, ba -boo -ya. Say, hey, ba -boo -ya. Say, hey, hey, hey. Then like a sheep, you say, ba. Ready? Say, ba. Say ba ya Say hey ba ya Say ba ya Say hey ba ya Say hey 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 Say ba Say ba boo ya. Hey ba boo ya. Ba boo ya. Hey ba boo ya. Say hey hey hey. Say ba boo ya. That's a true song. So the girl Kelly, I wonder what she's doing these days. Hope she's still writing songs. And uh, that'd be fun to know. So tales about tales. We could tell some tales about all sorts of people. I was thinking maybe the, um, maybe a tale about a different kind of dog since we've done a bunch of dog songs. Maybe we should do one about um, a hot dog. So I'll put that dog hat on. This is a different kind. It's kind of about, it's a true story. Again, most of these are mostly true, somewhat true some of the time. And it's about a, um, <clears throat> a man who was selling hot dogs at the ballpark. And this is, it really happened in Detroit and uh, when they opened Comerica Park and he would sing while he was selling hot dogs and he would sing about hot dogs. And so they, <laughs> they called him the singing hot dog man. And um, at first it wasn't going over so good. <laughs> And uh, they, they weren't really happy that he was singing while he was selling hot dogs. But after a while, I think they got used to it. So it's a, it's a tale about the hot dogs. So, or at least the hot dog man. I'll tune up real quick for you. There we go. You want it to sound just right. So it's about the hot dog man, and you can join in on the chorus, it's called, because it's you say, hot diggity dog. It's like, hot diggity dog on that part. You'll get it, right? We'll sing it a couple times through, and you'll figure it out. But it's a true story. It says there was a hot dog man in the baseball stand selling hot dogs for everyone. And the hot dog man, well, he had this plan to sing a song for everyone. He said, oh. That's your say, say, ah, 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 say it again, say, ah, 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 well, the big boss man didn't understand, he said, no singing in the baseball stands, you gotta remember, this is baseball, bug. you wanna sing a song, you should join a glee club, he went, Humming. Well, the big boss man finally saw the light. He 
said, yeah, I guess this could be all right. You can sing your song in the baseball stands. We'll call you the singing hot dog man. So when I mentioned about the um, baseball park, so in Detroit, the name of the team is the Tigers. So there was a song about Tigers, and Tigers have a long tail. Let me see if I can actually find the Tiger hat. Give me a second right there. I haven't worn that Tiger hat in about 147 years. Let me see if it's in there still. I know it's there somewhere. There's Santa's hat. No, that's not a Tiger. Let's see where that Tiger hat went. I know it's in there somewhere. Tiger, Tiger, Tiger. Where's that Tiger hat? Tiger hat, tiger, tiger, tiger hat, no, that's a frog, no, no, not that one. Oh, tiger hat must be all gone. Well, I got the leopard hat, that's kind of close, but tiger hat, I'll have to just do it without the tiger hat. And you say, slow down, tiger, ready, slow down, tiger, don't you drive so fast. Slow down, tiger. Don't drive so fast. I said, slow down, Tiger. You've been burning too much gas. Say, time out, Tiger. Time out, Tiger. Time to settle down. I said, time out, Tiger. You gotta settle down. Slow down, Tiger. Slow down, Tiger. Don't you drive so fast. Say, slow down, Tiger. Don't you drive so fast. Say, slow down, Tiger. You've been burning up too much gas. Time out, Tiger. Time to settle down. I said, time out, Tiger. I said two pasta songs. Who likes pasta? Some you guys do. Some of you guys like pasta. Well, there's another one, and it's kind of about a woman I know very well. In fact, it's my nana, and she's got a pool at her house. This is an old song by Bob McCann, and he's from Central Massachusetts. He told me this song many years ago. It's a tale, all right, but you know what? It's like my nana took after this song. Which came first? Nana or the song, it goes like this. And you're gonna sing along on it, says. Well, you can swim in our swimming pool anytime you please. It's not filled with water, it's filled with macaroni and cheese, macaroni and cheese, macaroni and cheese. All I want for dinner is macaroni and cheese. That's where you say macaroni and cheese. All I want for dinner is I want for dinner is macaroni and cheese. We got a little puppy dog, she's a Pekingese. She doesn't eat her dog food, she eats macaroni and cheese, macaroni and cheese, macaroni and cheese. All I want for dinner is macaroni and cheese. All I want for dinner is some kids like spaghetti. It just makes me sneeze. All I want for dinner is macaroni and cheese, macaroni and cheese, macaroni and cheese. All I want for dinner is macaroni and cheese. All I want for dinner is macaroni and cheese. All I want for dinner is macaroni and cheese. Macaroni and cheese. That's an old song from the old days. That's an old tale. You 
kind of a, a wise tale. I don't know why they call it that, but it doesn't seem very wise, but it would be interesting to have a pool full of macaroni and cheese, that's for sure. I was thinking we'll do this other song that I said about uh, tails, and I do have this special hat just for this song. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Someone with a tail, for sure. A tale and a tale to tell. Yes. I better put on my glass so I can see myself in the, and make sure my, you can tell. It's a unicorn hat. <laughs> so, long time ago when the earth was green, more kinds of animals than you've ever seen. They ran around free while the world was being born. The loveliest of all was the unicorn. Exactly. <laughs> so that was written actually by, because I like the book too. It was written by Shel Silverstein. Remember that book? So yeah, he wrote the one about the unicorn too. So anyway, somebody, I was telling tell them about that song. It's a little bit of a tale. I was telling about the song and uh, and they said, unicorns aren't real. Come on, Kev, unicorns aren't real. And, and I said, yes they are. They can be as real as you want them to be. That's what this song's all about. By using your imagination, it says, I, I wanted a unicorn, a rock and roll unicorn actually. And it says, some people say, unicorns aren't real. Listen to me, I'll tell you the deal. Unicorns can be as real as you want them to be. Use your imagination, let it run free. Well, I want a rock and roll unicorn. Plays music all night long until the early morn. She can play any instrument, from fiddle to flugelhorn. Rock and roll Maybe your unicorn has a tail of rainbow colors. Maybe your unicorn likes to swim. Maybe your unicorn has a hundred sisters and brothers. Maybe your unicorn's name is Jim. Well, I want a rock and roll. All night long until the early morn. Well, she can play any instrument from fiddle to flugelhorn. Rock and roll, you Rock and roll. Unicorn. Plays music all night long until the early morning. Well, she can play any instrument. Fiddle the flugel horn. Rock and roll unicorn. The rock and roll unicorn. Hey friends, Kevin Devine here, back with more Tales and Tales. This one's about somebody who's, uh, there's a head and a tail on it, but I'm not sure which is which. It's a wiggling worms, because worms on the ground, we've had a lot of rain lately, we've seen a lot of worms. And but I'm not sure which is the head and which is the tail. Kind of confusing sometimes, but we'll do the song anyway, and you gotta wiggle around, ready? Wiggling worms, wiggle all day. When it rains, they come out to play. Wiggling worms, wiggle all day. Wiggle worms, wiggle this way. And you gotta wiggle. Well, guess who came around? The robin, put out your wings. Well, the red, red robin, bobbin around. Sees those worms wiggling on the ground. They play the game of lost and found. Red, red robin, bobbin around. Maybe the robins and the worms can be friends. Maybe if the robins become vegetarians. Well, wiggle like a worm, wiggle and worms, wiggle all day. When it rains, they come out to play. Wiggle and worms, wiggle all day. Wiggle and worms, wiggle this way. Well, the red, red robin bobbing around it sees those worms wiggling on the ground. They play the game of lost and found. Red, red robin bobbing around. Maybe the robins and the worms can be friends. Maybe if the robins become vegetarians. 
Well, wiggle them worms, wiggle all day. When it rains, they come out to play. They come out to play. Hey, you know who else comes out to play sometimes? And they start out with a tail, and they end up without one. Frogs. That's right. And there's lots of tales about frogs. You know the one, there was that old fairy tale about the, uh, the princess kissing the frog. So I got my frog hat on. I don't know if you can see that. I got my frog hat on for you. And uh, so this one's a little different. It's about the frog might be a princess, not a prince. So we'll find out. But uh, frogs start as tadpoles. And when they're tadpole, they have a long tail. And then the tail disappears and their legs start growing. And then they don't have a tail anymore. So they start out that tail of the frog as they start out with a tail and then don't have a tail. Ready? This is for dancing. It goes, friendly little frog. Will you dance with me? You might be a princess. We'll just wait and see. You're green and slimy, but that's okay. We're just dancing anyway. Sitting on that lily pad all night long. Listen to her singing now. Hey, you know who swims around near the frogs, though, underwater? You can crawl around the floor. The little kids can crawl around the floor. And the big kids, we're going to do a part in here where I need you to sing along. If you ever heard of the Mills Brothers, this has got a Mills Brothers part of the song. And uh, they used to do a lot of harmonies where they pretended that they were playing horns. They really didn't have horns, but they pretended. So it's someone who swims around with the frog. And these people do have tails, or these animals do have tails. Turtles. I was out paddling on the river recently. And... Uh, and I did see a big turtle swimming, and they have a little tail helping them navigate a bit. Ready? Crawl around like a turtle. Big kids, get ready to sing. It says, I'll tell you how your singing part goes when you get there. Slowly, lowly turtle, there's no need to run. Slowly, lowly turtle, you got your own kind of fun. you want that's okay well slowly lowly turtle there's no need to run slowly lowly turtle you got your own kind of fun well lay on the log by the river slip into the stream swim around with the fishies there what a beautiful dream Crawl around, ready, and the big kids, you sing this part, you go pop, 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 well, you lay on the log by the river and slip into the stream, swim around with the fishies there, what a beautiful dream, slowly, with the turtles how about that they got a little tail you know who else I was thinking of we could do we had the um, robins in the song about worms mine not a song about birds I don't think I have my bird hat here today oh yeah it's there's a, it's kind of a bird hat 
It's a duck. Maybe we'll do two about ducks. I do have a duck hat here with me today. You see the duck hat okay? So it starts out like this. Again, it's a singing one. I like sing-alongs where you can just, all the words are la la la, so everyone can sing it. We don't have to worry about anyone not knowing the words. You just say la la la. I'll tell you when that part comes up, you'll know. You'll catch on right away. But ducks have feathers in the back. Remember the one, the five little ducks went out to play, or the one little duck with a feather on his back? He led the others to quack, 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 or she led the others to quack. Remember that one? Because ducks have, I had a pet duck, as a matter of fact, and um, two pet ducks when I was a kid. Instead of a dog, I had ducks. Anyway, so here's the song about birds. So it says about birds, then the ducks. Coming right up, it says, Little birds singing a summertime song. Hello, little birds, can I sing along? La, 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 la. out here while I was talking about ducks because people like to feed the ducks sometimes throw them some bread that sort of thing and maybe kids have dogs and cats those are fun we got a dog too he was gonna join me for some singing but he's taking a nap like he normally does he's really good at napping these days this one's about families and pets and friends and candy and cake and ice cream all sorts of cool things and says all you got to sing to begin is say do 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 say do 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 well i love my dog i love my cat love walking around in my goofy old hat but most of all i love my Pretty special to me, and here's where you say do 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 do. Well, I love ice cream and I love cake. Feeding the ducks a bun down by the lake. Oh, most of all, I love my family. They're pretty special to me. Say do 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 do. Well. Well, I love candy, but I brush my teeth Playing with my friends up and down the street But most of all, I love my family They're pretty special to me I love my dog, I love my cat Love walking around in my goofy old hat, but most of all, I love my family. All right, well, I got the piano here because I was going to tell you a little story. I got kind of a fancy hat on here. It's kind of a fancy story about a fancy kind of guy named uh, Louie. Well, Luigi was his name. Luigi Baccarini or Boccarini as they say. 
Yeah. He lived a long time ago and played uh, the harpsichord and lots of other instruments like the viola da gamba. They had and flutes and harpsichords and things. And he, I kind of made up a little story about him. So it's another tale. And he liked one kind of music. And his wife, Miss Baccarin, she liked a different kind of music. time of year. We came up with this song one time in January for holidays and it was, we were uh, singing it for Martin Luther King Day, but you could sing it anytime. And I want to thank everybody at the Belleville Library. Thanks so much uh, to Miss Tara and all the librarians for inviting me. My name is Kevin Devine. Great to see everybody again. And uh, we'll sing again very soon. This one's called I Have a Dream and I'll say it. You can say it back. It goes like this. Say, I have a dream. I have a dream. Say, you have a dream. You have a dream. If we dream together, we can do most anything. I have a plan. You have a plan. If we plan together, we can make this whole world better. All it takes is all you've got each and every day. All it takes is all you've got. Thanks, thanks for singing along. Have a great rest of your summer. See you again soon. <laughs>